Yo, what's up, YouTube? This is your man, Junior, a.k.a. Smoking Guns, out here in Tucson, Arizona, representing the Ultimate Fight Club, giving you the latest content in boxing and MMA news that is out. So, before we get started, make sure to subscribe to the channel, hit the like button on the video, and if you have anything to say, hit me up in the comment section. But it looks like that David Benavidez versus Caleb Plant fight card is really stacking up. And one of the main things that I was stating when it was announced is that I'm hoping they stack up that card so they can make this a pay-per-view worthy type of event and it looks like they are doing that in fact especially with them putting jose valenzuela versus chris colbert on that card because that's definitely going to be a very intriguing fight but they end up putting another intriguing fight on this card with jesus ramos versus joey spencer on the undercard on that event and this is actually coming out in boxingscene.com where it states Jesus Ramos versus Joey Spencer to land on Benavidez plant March 25th Showtime pay-per-view event. And in this article, it goes on to state, a pair of unbeaten rising contenders are set to meet on the undercard of a highly anticipated grudge match. BoxingScene.com has learned that terms have been finalized for a junior middleweight clash between Jesus Ramos and Joey Spencer. The matchup is the first of three undercard bouts confirmed for the March 25th Showtime pay-per-view event from MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. The show is headlined by the already announced David Benavidez versus Caleb Plant interim WBC super middleweight title fight. Quote, now with this news coming out, dude, this is definitely going to be a very, very intriguing fight because both of these dudes, I follow their careers and both of these dudes are super talented in that 154 pound division. And with both of these dudes being undefeated on the rise in that damn division, it's super cool to be able to see these dudes meet right now so early in their careers. And you can really say that both of their, both of their records are pretty comparable. The only thing that I would do is I would actually give a dude like Jesus Ramos the edge and the careers or the opposition just for the simple fact is with the last opponent that he faced in Santa Maria I would actually say that Santa Maria is better on anybody on Joey Spencer's resume just for the simple fact is Santa Maria he actually beat Abel Ramos who was Jesus Ramos's uncle and he also beat uh, Devin Alexander Michael Fox so with the opposition that Jesus Ramos and Joey Spencer has faced I would definitely give Jesus Ramos the edge in the competition and I would also give him the edge just for the simple fact is he has fought more 10 round fights in his career but like I said both of these dudes are super talented both of these dudes got knocked out power both of these dudes got cracked you got to do like Jesus Ramos I think he's 19 and know then you got Joey Spencer who's 16 and know so like I said with them being so talented and being going to come up in their careers in that 154 pound division it's super cool to see that they are meeting right now in their damn careers but I guess only time is going to tell who exactly will win that fight but when the fight goes down I'm definitely going to be checking it out on that damn David Benavidez versus Caleb Plant undercard you dig so I hope you guys like the video if you guys like the video make sure to hit the like button if you're not subscribed make sure to subscribe to the channel and if you guys have any kind of questions any kind of comments hit me up in the comment section and I'll be sure to hit you guys up all right so I hope you like the video holla at your man